today's 21 day fix recipe, I'm going to be showing you how to make a baked apple dessert. And this I like to eat in the evening when I'm craving something sweet and this just satisfies my sweet tooth. It tastes just like an apple pie. So what you will need for this recipe is some ground cinnamon, some Himalayan sea salt or any kind of sea salt that you have, a nice clean yummy apple. Um, Today I'm using a Braeburn, you could use a Granny Smith, anything that you like. I like the Braeburn. And then you will want two teaspoons of melted coconut oil. Mine is already solidifying, but it'll still work. And then you will also need a small baking dish to put your baked apples inside of. Now all you need to do is cut your apple into bite-sized cubes. Now that we have all of our nicely chopped apples, we're going to place them in our baking dish. And I'm just going to fill it a little bit of the way. And I'm going to grind some sea salt on that just a teeny tiny bit. And then a dash of cinnamon. And then we're gonna put some more on top of that. Don't worry if your little baking tin or ramekin is too small. Um, trust me, it won't be. Because <laughs> this will all bake down and shrink up um, when you bake it. So put the last little bit on there. Sprinkle more cinnamon and some sea salt. Now you might be wondering, well, Becky, why in the heck are you putting like <laughs> sea salt on your apples, on your sweet treat? Trust me, this will really make your yummy apple dish more like pie. And last but not least, you're gonna take your melted coconut oil and you're just gonna pour that over the top. And I'm making a mess because I let it sit too long <laughs> after I melted it. But this will still work. All of that good stuff out. So what does this little snack count as? It counts as one purple container, that's your fruit container, and two teaspoons, and that's your coconut oil. The cinnamon is free, the salt is free. Now all you need to do to finish this guy is to put it in a 400 degree oven and bake it for only 15 minutes and you have a delicious, yummy dessert. So this, my friends, is the final result. These apples have gone down in size and soaked up all the flavor in that cinnamon and the sea salt, along with that coconut oil. These are nice and warm. I love to have these in the evening for a nice sweet treat at night when I'm craving something. Um, so if you try this recipe, please let me know what you thought. Please hit the like button if you did, and I will see you guys next time for the next recipe.